Yes, it's true. I am fat. I am old. And because of that, I am wearing a heart rate monitor because I am wildly out of shape. Just coming in from two miles and I wanted to share with you whether or not I believe the Garmin HRM Pro Plus, the Plus, it's the new one, is it worth the money? Well, you'll have to decide. But let me tell you, I'm wearing it right now right directly under my man boobs and i'll save you from seeing that but it's right about here it's a little thing i'll show it in the video we'll cut away to show it to you that sits just underneath your boobs yeah right there and it works right out of the box super convenient it's synced up to my garmin 4 wonder 165 without any problems which was great no problems. It's synced up. It works with the app, with the watch. And what it's doing is tracking my heart rate. And the reason why that's so important is because, man, my VO2 max is poor. It's like 29, maybe 30 on a good day. It used to be like 50, you know, even better than that. But uh, it's been a few years since I've been running. So I am training for a 5K in May and a half marathon in November. So one of the things I like about this heart rate monitor, which I got for about $110 on Amazon, somewhere around there. You might be able to get a little more of a discount if you act fast. It's a little more expensive than the rest, but one, it was really convenient because it synced really fast with my watch. But two, it records your step and your heart rate without your watch. Even if it's not on, it is recording as long as you're wearing it. So when you sync later in the day, it can capture all of those steps. If you're counting your steps, you want to get 10,000 steps, it's, you just put it on. Uh, you don't have to worry about your watch being charged or on. And also, the battery is supposed to last what I think about a year uh, with an hour or two of, of workout each day. So 365 hours at least of battery time, which is great, right? So that is good. I like that bet. It just works out of the box. And the one thing I really like, because this is not my first Garmin HRM heart rate monitor chest strap. The old ones, if you had to change the battery, they had these itty bitty screws that were totally a pain in the ass. You had to get one of those like little screwdrivers that you use for your glasses and my eyes don't work that well, you know? I'm like, Ugh. So this one, it just pops off, right? And it's secure, has a, a rubber ring around it so the battery won't pop out. It's really in there secure, but once you lift the latch, you can just pop in a new battery right and that's that's great and you know who knows if this will last me a year with the amount of work that my heart does it could be a few months who knows i'll let you know so in my book yes it's worth it but it depends a hundred dollars is a lot of money for a lot of people and if your watch is giving you the metrics that you need stick to your watch just use your watch now i do appreciate the uh reading on this but i can tell you i was monitoring it I'm at like at least 10% slower. My watch is definitely reading higher. I, I tested this against my Apple Watch. I'm going to do some further investigation as well. And my Apple Watch was reading my heart rate a little bit lower, as is this chest monitor. So I'm not sure if perhaps just off of the wrist here, my left arm is kind of wonky. I don't know. I'm not a scientist. But that's what I'm seeing. So worth it. It's up to you to decide, but I'm really glad I have it because at my age and my fitness condition, which is pitiful, I'm disgusted with myself. Seriously, I've let myself go, but it doesn't have to stay that way. It doesn't have to stay that way. I'm on my way back and you're going to see it right here. So like and subscribe and check in. I'll be coming to you every week with a new video telling you how my training is going. Cheer me on. Your encouragement is going to help me get through that first 5K, which I'll share here. But then I'm running a half marathon at Joshua Tree National Park in California near Death Valley in November with my daughters. It's going to be amazing. We've got months to plan and get to know each other, right? So let me know who you are. I'll give you a shout out next video. Thank you. I'll talk to you later. I love you all. Bye.